Well, over there in the patch of, in that patch of grass, turn it over. That patch of grass, I just found this random dead Luna moth. Mm -hmm. You know, Luna moths, they only live for about a week before they are dead. They spent the most of their lives as the little moth worms. The caterpillars. Yeah, the whole moth worm caterpillar. Well, look at how pretty it is. Look at that. Wait, wait. <laughs> it's really pretty. Wait, Shanti, hold it a little, little more back. Okay, now hold it right there. Look at that. That is pretty. Now look at this. Look at how much detail its little eye spots have. Yeah. That could scare off any predator. Also, all of this fluff is actually scales. Show me the fluff on your finger. These. This may look like fluff, but this now, is a scale. Of course, of course, Shanti knows that if this Luna moth were alive, she would not be allowed to brush scales off of it or. Yeah, because those scales are vital for its flying and or, stuff. Or handle it or anything. But this one, I, I mean, I think it probably just passed away today, but. um. Poor lunar moth. But Shanti has been fascinated with looking at it, and it was her idea. Look at its little feathery. To, to get a video of it. Look at it. Um. Look. It's so it's. Like Shanti, hold it still. Let me see if I can get this to focus. I don't know if it will or not. Come on. Okay, it won't focus. Let, let me back up until. Okay, net net. It can focus from here. The antenna are like little feathers. Mm-hmm. Now, in real life, you if you encounter one of these, it should be on like a stick on like one of these trees or something. If you just find it in a patch of grass like what we did, it's probably dead. If it's dead, you should, you can touch it. If you're really fascinated like me, you can go ahead, hold it. Look at some of its scales. But if it is like on a tree or something, where, where it is pretty hidden, do not touch it. Like. I repeat, do not touch it. Right. To check if it's dead, create a disturbance around it, cause. <laughs> well, if it's hanging onto a tree, you know it's alive because yeah. its legs have strength to hang on. But this one was just laying in the grass. Just taking a, a have a nap in the grass. And I feel like I got stung by something. Probably a mosquito. Is it normal for for me to be able to feel when a mosquito bites me? Well, this is a Luna moth. Okay, so is that it? So look at look at its eyes. Oh, let me see how close I can get. Uh, this won't this won't focus right up on it. Back up a little bit. Okay, it, it can now. It's oh, it's focused now. It's focused real well. Shanti, don't don't hold it down. I was holding it down so you can uh, get the close upness of its wings too. Okay, so let me get its wings again. A little bit foggy there now it's clear all right so this has been shanti patel with lunar moth 101